Now to a disturbing story out of Gloucester, Massachusetts. There's been a dramatic increase in teenage pregnancies there, and authorities think they know why. Some say the high school girls planned it as part of a secret pact. Michelle Miller explains. It's news that has people talking in this sleepy fishing village. I think it's awful. They're kids having kids. 17 girls at Gloucester High School not only got pregnant, but according to some, it was no accident. Pregnancy was a desired outcome. So they did it on purpose? That's what it sounds like, yes. School officials discovered the pregnancy pact after some girls seemed disappointed that their pregnancy test from the school nurse came back negative. They will have a baby to, as you know, part of their life, give them status. This gives them status? Motherhood, yes, gives them, gives them status. Status in Gloucester is hard to come by. The once thriving fishing community has seen jobs drift overseas. Economic depression has left many teens trying to fill the void. It sort of gives you the, the impression of being an adult and independent. It may give you an opportunity for unconditional love and attention from the baby and also that you give to the baby. According to the superintendent, all the girls were 16 or younger. Most of the fathers weren't in high school and at least one of them was a 24-year-old man. There's four people pregnant this year, and then the next next week they'd be like, there's nine people pregnant this year, and then there was ten. Be okay. Amanda Ireland just graduated from Gloucester High, mother of three-year-old Haley. She says she's trying to warn her peers about the tough road ahead. Don't, <laughs> don't try to get pregnant. I mean, people say I know what it's like because I have siblings, but you really don't. No one knows until they actually go through it, and it's a lot of work. School officials have their work cut out for them. They're now considering a plan to provide birth control services at the school in the fall. But their biggest challenge? How to change the mindset of some of the girls who come here. Michelle Miller, CBS News, Gloucester, Massachusetts.